All right, this is Sparkle's hairdo. She didn't wear this hairdo for a week. I mean, two weeks, a little over two weeks, week and a half. And it's going to rain tomorrow, so I'm not going to wash it. I'm going to wash it on Friday, but we did a deep conditioner in it, and then we washed it and did all that stuff. And it needs to be washed again. But I'm not going to wash it because it's cold and it's raining tomorrow. Yeah. It's raining tomorrow and Friday. I'm going to wash it. She get off of school, condition it again. And what am I going to do? Put some, I'm going to put some twist in it. But she can't go to, she can't do this no more. This is over with. It lasts while I can. It's still nicely moisturized and all that. So, yeah, and I'll show you what it's looking like as I go and do a little bit by a little bit. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, my beautiful people. What's up? We're going to do Sparkle's hair today. Um, just in a natural, protective hairstyle. And, yeah. I'll be back. <laughs> okay, so we're watching Disney Plus. And can't find a part in comb, so we're going to pretty much stick with the same parts. Oh, I'm glad I didn't watch it. Because it <laughs> she would have been getting a bun or something without no part in comb. Because, yeah. Anyway, yeah, I got these um, things I got from Sheen. So we don't use rubber bands, a little more protective hairstyle. And this is what I have done so far. Alright, so I retook this down because I had to make this into two because my plan is the. Uh, she pretty much had like a some type of fancy mohawk. I don't believe I showed you her hair, but the last time I did it, but I'm going to show you this time. So I'm going to crisscross these into these like this and then and this one like this one. So I need it to make it two instead of one. So I took it down and redid it. Here's this one. I'm going to do the other one and then I'll be back. All right. I just twisted these around. I just... Take that and I'm going to open up the rubber band and just twist the end of the hair around the rubber band so it can stay. Sometimes they do come loose, but that's how that's going to look before I add some silver clips to this. Alright, you get the gist. It's like a little African protective hairstyle. It's giving me like an African vibe. I won't let you down, Father. And I got some more to do, and then I'll show you when I'm done. Good luck, son. This has certainly gone down in Yellow and Arthur. Alright. Moisturizer's coming out. So, I took these, put them close to the middle. Put the ponytails close to the middle. I did that to all of them. And now I'm going to take to this one and folks need is a hero. wrap it yeah. I'm it this way. I'm hurt this you. way. And, uh, I, I happen to be a hero. I'll do it this way. Take it and wrap it around that one and be back. Uh, then we just have this one little section that's like in a bun. I think I'm going to repeat that. Two silver clips and then clip it to the base of the ponytail right here. Like I did down here. And this time on this one, I added a silver bead. Oh, you can't even see this one thing. And then I add clear and white beads. Just to give it another little texture and a pop. Okay, I don't know what I want to do with this. Um, last time I kind of like put it in a bun and then stuck some, some curly cues down on the side. I know you didn't while I'm recording. Hey, be quiet. I'm recording. Um, so I'm thinking about doing some type of weird stand up situation like this and then let the curls fall down like that, but I don't know how long that's going to stay like that. To do it a little bit different. It is a little bit different than last time because I made this one pony, but one in the back one, it was two, and these on the side were two ponytails, and I made them one. 
So just a little different, especially since we don't need to last for two weeks. We only need to last a Friday when she come home to school and we put some, do our hair for Easter. But anyway, that's if I get, if I don't be too busy to do it. Because I might, I might not, she might be redoing it. So it's like, because yeah, I don't have time for stuff. But anyway, because I got to do a lot of things. Still got to go grocery shopping for Easter. Anyway, we're jumping off subject. So let me figure out how I'm going to do the top of this and then I'll be back. Oh, my battery is too low. Oh, wow. Hold on, you guys. Alright, so I added a bead right here. And I'm going to put a ponytail, like two puff balls there. <laughs> my point is to try to have it kind of standing up, leaning to the side with curls. If it works, it works. If it don't, it don't. All right. So, <laughs> it's a little weird. But I'm trying to do it like a, an African hairstyle type situation. So I have a bead, another bead, and then another bead. And then I'm just going to twist this curly. I'm going to get some gel and just curl the ends up before I did it. I was going to take these two, um, twist it, and then attach it to those two right there. I could still do it, but Sparkle, you sure you want it? At least you want it, um, the ends curl? So Sparkle likes it. Because I was going to take it like this and then connect it to these two right here. Because it wasn't really working how I wanted to work. But we're going to try it her way. And I will be back. Alright. <laughs> so we did her hair. Um, I finished her hair. She likes the ponytail going like that. It's different. I like it. It's, <laughs> it's a little goofball looking. But it's, it's different. I like it. And here's the products that we use. We use some of this black casserole miracle protection extra hole braid and lock twist and pretty much I'll use it as an edge control and then I'll use a little bit of this and I like this gel this is a new gel from Kinteen it's an avocado styling gel for natural hair for curls curls and waves and it has avocado, I already said avocado oil and shea butter in it and I think I like this better than my good old tang what's the name of that the old faithful gel everybody used everybody use it what is it called treasure sparkle it's like no it's like a green, what's the name of it glittery, i don't know uh, y'all know y'all know the gel it's all the black people the using for natural hair it starts with a d and it has a and it has like one of the pops that you pop off y'all know what i'm talking about i think i like this one better it's crazy i think i like this better I'm liking this gel, y'all. I, I, I don't. I, I, I'm gonna tell you if I like it better, but I will be buying this again. And we use this for a moisturizer. I didn't have to use too much because our hair was already done and it already had oil in it and moisturizer and everything. I used it last time. I use it, so I just refreshing it with this. And it's a um, it's a leave-in conditioner. And I, I seem to get this a lot. I get this all the time for whatever reason. And a D Golden. We on the phone. A DIY spritz. That I use and it just has a little um, rose water in there. It has um, here, hold it, smuggle. Rose water has. Get off of that! You just messed up the clothes we're trying to dry. Why did you do that? Ooh, fix them back up, Sparkle. Can you stop? Yeah. I'm trying to do this video. Okay, it has some rose water in there, some bottled water, um, some oil of your choice. I. I don't remember what oil I put in. I think I put some grapeseed oil in there. You and I put what? essential oils in there. Um, a couple of essential oils. And that's it. I didn't... Oh, and I put some... Um, oh, okay. I put some and aloe vera gel in there. Just a little bit of this. And you put that minty stuff in it. I put some aloe vera gel. Hold this. In this spritz bottle. Aloe vera. And I put some vegetable glistening. Just a little drop of everything in there. And that's my spritz. And yeah. So her hair is done. Let me have her turn around, then we're out of here. Sparkle is saying it's giving a dead tree vibe at the top. <laughs> but she wanted it that way, and this is what the back is looking like. Lift your head. 
I like the extra touch with the beads. It's giving a dead tree with the curls up there. If it would have sticked up, let me see how I look. If it sticks up straight, it would be kind of cool. But it's going to lay down there. Okay, stop moving. I'm trying to show them how it's going up there. And that's how we're going to leave it. So this is our hairdo. Turn around, Sparkle. Yeah, that's my body. Turn to the side, mm -hmm. to the side. This is her protective hair. Stop with your head. Here you go. This is her protective hairstyle. I'm going to call this uh, African style mohawk. The African dead tree mohawk. <laughs> All right, until the next time. This is the stable. I got this oversized bracelet. Oh, I'll tell you, oversized bracelet.